Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. This is Rachel Langston. I'm an owner and craft educator here at Oak and Lamb. Today we're going to be talking about 10 last minute Cricut Christmas gift ideas. Whew, that was a mouthful, but it's going to be great. We're going to share 10 with you that we have created through this past year that you guys can make right now. I know it's super close to Christmas, but if you're like most of the people who I've talked to and myself, we're a little behind on making or purchasing some gifts this year. So if you need some inspiration on some last minute gift ideas, you're going to get that in this video. Definitely stay tuned. I can't wait to share these with you. Before we jump into the video, it is completely free to you guys to subscribe and like this video. So if you're not already subscribed to the Oak and Lamb YouTube channel, what are you missing out on? Go ahead and click subscribe and ring that bell to get notified when more incredible videos like this come out. Always like the video if you enjoy it as well. Every little bit helps. Our first project that you guys can make right now that'll be perfect for Christmas is the Power Wash Tumblers. These were super popular, founded on TikTok, of course, like a lot of amazing craft trends that happened in 2022. And this one was a game changer. You use that Dawn Power Wash and some spray paints and really create a super unique and one of a kind project. You can put whatever you want on this, personalize it with names, put your favorite cup file on it, whatever you want to do. We do have several different cup slash tumbler projects in this uh, kind of compilation today because number one, they're easy, they're cheap, and we love to do them. We've probably made a dozen or more different types of tumblers this year, and we are not shameful at all about it. We love them. So we're going to include several of them in this video for you guys because you probably already have the products to make these on hand. Throughout this video, there will be a lot of projects that we do have detailed tutorials on. So if you are curious on how to make the projects that we're sharing with you, I will have the videos detailing how to create them linked above me and also in the description of this video. So you can click those, watch them and learn how to make them super quick, super easy. Along with us making a lot of cups and tumblers and mugs this past year, another craft product we have used so much is UV resin. This project that we made using UV resin to create these adorable little tags, these are acrylic keychains. They are super, super cute. You guys will be able to make these in no time. You can mass produce these super quickly for all kinds of different family members or keep it generic and have one cut file on all of them or kind of like the other project, you can use names to personalize them or whatever you wanna do. But one thing's for sure, they are so cute. This next one will be super cute for kids and adults alike. It is a print and cut puzzle. So this is gonna use some different adaptive tools if you have a Cricut Maker, um, or you can buy a pre-made puzzle and kind of work your way into creating your own puzzle with Print and Cut uh, with an X-Acto knife or something like that. So you can really make this your own, whether you have a Maker or a Cricut Explorer. There are a lot of different ways you can go about this, even sublimation. There are sublimation puzzle blanks out there. So get creative with this one, but you will absolutely love making this, especially if you have someone who is a newlywed or took some family pictures or something like that. These would make a great gift. These little puzzles are super fun, easy to make. They would also make really great stocking stuffers. One thing we haven't used nearly enough this year is felt. We need to use it more in 2023. That needs to be one of our New Year's resolutions, I feel like, is to use more felt. If you guys have a Cricut Maker and you have no use for that rotary blade, let us give you a use for it. This incredible banner is adorable. You can use this for all types of different things. Becca made this one for Fallon's bedroom. So it's just going to hang in a room or on her door. It has her name on it. It took literally 15 minutes to make. It was so quick, so easy. And if you're wondering where we got the adorable colors of this felt, we got it from BenzyDesigns.com. That is our favorite felt distributor. We get no kickback from it, but we love it. So I'll link that down below if you guys are in the market for felt. A quick tip is that the felt you use, the quality of it is really going to make or break your project. You don't want to be going out to your craft store and getting those 30 cent felt sheets. Get a good quality felt. It's little things like that that take a project from beginner to professional looking. So make this banner for someone in your life this holiday season. It's so cute. We love personalized gifts. If you guys are a crafter and you have a Cricut, honestly, there is no reason you shouldn't be creating personalized gifts. They're amazing. They're super easy to make and they really uh, have a good personal touch to them. So everybody on your wish list this holiday season needs a personalized gift. 
sharing yet another tumbler with you. This is a stainless steel tumbler and we etched it using ferric chloride. And this was hands down the easiest and the quickest tumbler that we made all year long. You could mass make these in one afternoon. It takes no time at all. You can do it all indoors, super safe, super easy. We loved it. Honestly, it took no time at all to make this. Becca created them. Uh, we got the ferric chloride fairly cheap off of Amazon, and this is the only one you'll ever need. You will not need to repurchase this. Kind of like etching cream, you're, you're just not gonna need to repurchase it. You're gonna be able to use the supply that you have for a really, really long time. So uh, we're gonna link that video just like all the others so you can learn how to do that super quick, super easy. But again, we love cups, cups and tumblers and mugs. They make great gifts because you can personalize them. And for Christmas, a super easy thing to do is to fill it with the recipient's favorite candy, wrap it in cellophane, things like that. Add a little print and cut tag to it. There's a lot of ways you can kind of dress up or take these tumblers up a notch to make them a really nice professional looking gift. This next project might be one of my favorites of the year and it wasn't even mine. Becky created these adorable little plant stakes with names on them. She actually got inspired when her and a group of friends went to Waco, Texas. Joanna Gaines' sister has a shop called Fernie's and it's actually a little shop where you can go in and buy a plant. But the catch, is, it's not a catch, it's like a, a huge plus. Every plant has a name. They have a little stake in them with a little name on there. And we all thought it was absolutely to die for. Becca was sending me pictures and it was the cutest so when she got home she bought some supplies and created some and they are adorable so now is the perfect time to go raid your local home depot your local lowe's and grab some little house plants and you can create these super easily it's adorable like who wouldn't want to receive a little personalized named plant i, I don't even know they're adorable so yeah grab that stuff if you can make some plants for some of your uh guests on your guest list and they will love it Everyone loves t-shirts. I know I do. I love receiving t-shirts to be able to wear. I'm a t-shirt gal. I never really wear anything more fancy than that. And if some people on your list for this holiday season also love t-shirts, making them would be a great, really cheap way to just kind of cross that name off your Christmas list. So this particular t-shirt is made using HTV heat transfer vinyl, but with a twist. We are using screen print confetti to take it up a notch. It's amazing. So watch that live video if you haven't already to learn how to create these. It really is a game changer when it comes to heat transfer vinyl. You can add a splash of color, a splash of part sparkle. It just really does a great job at taking a a, you know, like a, not boring, but like an ordinary t-shirt up another notch. You could get red and green and make a Christmas shirt or you really whatever you want. If you go, I'll link down below the uh, screen print confetti. If you go and you look at all the colors, honestly, you'll be inspired. There's some with glitter. There's neon colors, really bright colors, really muted colors. You can find whatever you're looking for, which is amazing. So check out that video and learn how to make these t-shirts using screen print confetti. Way easier than you think. Not very time consuming at all. It'll be great to make for the holiday season. A really practical gift that you could make someone is a set of these photo resin coasters. They took me almost no time to make. I made them during a live stream. They were fun, they were easy, and you guys can make them, of course, with the recipient's photos, which is great. A personalized gift in the form of their own photos is something super personal to them. So you could make the resin coasters the base color, a color that would match their aesthetics in their home or anything like that. We used glitter, which of course, that's super fun. So take these in your own direction, add some originality, use only black and white photos, whatever you want to do to kind of step these up and make these your own. But a set of these adorable coasters would be incredible for anybody to receive for Christmas. I don't know about you all, but I really like to replace my doormat seasonally. So let's say you have one for spring, for summer, for fall, and for winter. Well, winter is coming to an end in a little while after Christmas, and then spring will be upon us. So it would be a great gift idea to go ahead and grab a doormat and make a stencil doormat. Now, you can make stencils with your Cricut. You can make them cutting by hand with uh, some construction paper or what have you. They're super easy to do with acrylic 
yellow paint and pouncing or there's a lot of people that use spray paint. We like the freezer paper method. You can't just go get a doormat uh, from Target or Hobby Lobby or anything like that that just has such a personal fun meaning. So personalize these with a funny quote, an inside joke, or the recipient's last name. Keep it classy, keep it classic. That would be super cute to do as well. But roll these up, tie a little ribbon around them. It would make a really cute uh, project to make for someone for the holidays. And again, if it's not very expensive to create uh, homemade doormats as well. So do think about that on your list if it's coming up close to Christmas and you need something easy to make. Uh, run down to Hobby Lobby or Target. They usually have some blank doormats. Uh, Amazon has some, but again, if you're doing the super last minute, you might not be able to wait on a shipment. So go check around for some blank or plain doormats. There should be some around your area and make some handmade personalized doormats. Last but not least is another tumbler project. These are fabric tumblers. Uh, we're pretty sure we saw this on TikTok as we saw most of our craft trends like I mentioned earlier. So this one is no different. You can take your own fabric from any, of course, craft store or from your own stash of fabric and wrap it around a tumbler with some Mod Podge, add some um, UV resin, some vinyl to personalize it, and you have an incredible gift idea. This is adorable. Now think about tumblers that we've made in the past. None of them can be customized quite to the degree of adding fabric to them. Think about a fabric store. Think about going in your local Joann's or Hobby Lobby. The fabric section is huge, whether it be like sports teams or pets or occupations. There are literally hundreds of thousands of different types and colors and patterns of fabric that you can choose to really, really personalize a tumbler like this. So if you're looking for something to go the extra mile when it comes to comes to customization this is the project that you need to create uh, these are also they don't take a lot of time to create so again last minute they're super last minute friendly for the holidays go ahead and make some really great fabric tumblers you will not regret it what did you all think of these 10 last minute gift ideas i need a comment down below letting me know which was your favorite or which ones you are going to make right now this holiday season I can't wait to share more incredible videos like this with you all. If you do enjoy videos like this, you would love Oak and Lamb. We are an incredible crafted community here that only wants to make you a better crafter every single day. So whether you have a Cricut, whether you have a laser cutter, if you're passionate about sublimation, woodworking, sewing, and so much more, we can help you here at Oak and Lamb. We have a amazing digital community filled with hundreds of cut files that are added to every single month. All of those come with a free commercial use license, meaning that you can make and sell anything you make with our cut files completely legally and completely free at no extra cost to you in that membership. We also have an exclusive Facebook community, which is some of our members' favorite perk. You can go on there, ask questions, post photos of your project to get feedback on, and overall just talk to people in a like-minded crafting community. That helps out so much. You won't believe how amazing it is over there in that community. Along with that, we do have some free resources and some free courses included in our membership. The newest of which is a Cricut course. If you have a Cricut under your tree or you think you might, or maybe you purchase one for Black Friday, that is gonna be essential to you being able to know and learn your machine super quickly. From opening the box and what you can expect inside that box to using print and cut, differences in vinyl, we go through everything with you guys all the way down to things that Cricut doesn't tell you, like how you need to calibrate your machine if your print and cut isn't working properly just different things to make sure that you guys are confident. We have an entire course completely free to members for you about that. So if you have a Cricut, uh, if you are new to Cricut, or maybe you've had one for a couple years, you could even learn a lot in that Cricut course. We have a great printable workbook with that as well that you guys might want to print out, get bound and laminated and keep close to you because there's a lot in there, which mats you use for which materials, different terminology definitions that could really help you in design space and when working with physical materials, a lot of things like that that you just can't get anywhere else. So we hope that you look towards Oak and Lamb to find all of that amazing stuff. Stuff. 
We are running an incredible sale through the end of the year for $45 off your annual membership with us. So if you want to grab that, use the code JINGLE, J-I-N-G-L-E, at checkout to grab $45 off. Every consecutive year you stay with us, you also continue to get $45 off, which is something we do at no other sale any other time of year. It's the best time to join. Thank you guys so much. I look forward to welcoming you as a member of our flock, and I'll see you another day for another video.